what is one one attribute you can um, or one thing about yourself you can say which made you successful what was it you're not going to like this answer but recently i've kind of become convinced that luck had a lot to do with it um you know but but no i agree completely <laughs> because yes i agree <laughs> but but you know not not in a sense like lottery luck but just trying a lot of different things right to get yeah. lucky and so I kind of feel like that's a completely underrated thing. I mean, I mean, you know, like, for example, um, we, we had just just to go back to like the jet days. I was working crazy hours at jet. It was a startup, very fast moving like a rocket. But then I still made time to try my own stuff and go and build something on my own for my own projects and side projects and things like that. And then and then the craziest thing is like uh, something would come up there that then I would be somehow able to tie back to work and so when I went back to work I had a crazy idea let's try this thing I would I would I would sell the business partner that hey I know we're gonna build this affiliate program but let's do it for influencers let's just go for influencers first let's not let's not let's not bother with these other um, and and let's build this influencer tool and so it's like it's like it's like these these steps and all this extra stuff just trying things kind of led me to do things that ultimately um, I would say made me pretty lucky you know but but it's just throwing different things at the wall and then you see kind of you know what's sticking and what's working and I think this is so important like so many people undervalue this right like if you're not working on the right thing that adds the right value it's really hard to move up really fast H how are you gonna do that if if the project you worked on for the last two years fails okay you know you're not gonna get fired but you're not gonna get promoted right and so and so to get promoted, I mean, you got to look at the things that matter and you got to move the needle on it, you, you know, to, to and, and that's luck a little bit. Right. Because because you, you need the opportunity. But I also think you could build your own opportunities like you could basically try a lot of different things and you could you could you know, you you have a say as a um, you know, I sort of. The way we used to the way we used to run it is I would tell people you have at least one third of a say at the table when you are talking to business and product you, you know you can push back and maybe they can override you if the two of them are against you but maybe you could sway one of them and then suddenly you're going in a different direction if you feel really strongly in your gut saying like hey if we just do this this way we're going to make millions let's just do this i mean as an engineer you have to kind of be awake to that you have to be paying attention to that and so you have to have um i mean you need kind of the ownership and some of the other stuff we talked about earlier but but basically um just just trying different things and seeing that you are not just on this train ride and you're not being taken along somewhere you could you could move the train in the other direction and you know you could convince people to move the train in the other direction and then you can get lucky because you know if if it's obvious that the project is going to fail you could you could kind of see it right like this is not going to generate the kind of revenue this is not going to do anything and so why am i still writing code on this like i would say at that point just look to switch teams even like that's not going to, you know, you need to get, you need to get lucky. And, and if, if the thing's going to crash, you need to be outspoken about it because your career is on the line. Correct. And so I, I'd say, yeah, you know, I don't know if that kind of answers your question. It's definitely not lotto luck, but it's, but it's for sure, you know, consistently working right. on things that, that, that kind of made a big impact. And, and I'd say, you know, it's just, it's just a lot of trial and error. And, and certainly there was some things that, that, that failed too. Right. But, you know, looking back at those failures, I mean, they feel minor because we, we cut our, we cut the cord quick and we just, we just sort of, you know, raised the white flag. Like, let's not, we're done with this. Like, let's move to the next thing because this is, this is it. It's not, it's not really going to work. So I don't know. It's a lot easier to do this in a startup. I mean, in a big company, people are kind of set on their ways. It's a lot harder to steer the ship, but even in a big company, I mean, you know, people understand, right? Like if your project and your, your feature does not deliver any business value, you're not going to be moved this fast. And so if you if you tell people that like the goal is this, they might just listen to you. And then, you know, you kind of work on and, and similarly, they might have their own. And I don't just mean that the engineer knows what the heck to build. I mean, they might have their own reasons. The product team has very, very valuable insights. They've studied the users. They understand the market. There's all these other things. Right. And so and so you listen to those people. And if it sounds like, OK, this is probably a pretty good rabbit hole to chase. You side with that person, not the person that's going to like, um, you know, kind of right. let you let you let you just be all off to the side and, and, and trucking along on this thing that's set to fail. That's a disaster. Basically, you want to you want to work on, you know, you want to try a lot of different things 
and, and you want to try to make yourself um, lucky. And I don't know if that, that, that answers your question, but I think that if I had to get one thing, no, it, that's really does. The, the number one reason why I climbed so fast. We added massive business value like over and over again, but we had a lot of failures in there, but the failures didn't count because we didn't spend a year on it. You know, they, 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 they get tossed out the window. Right. <laughs> true, true. No, I completely agree with you because I see even my case and, and you know, many of our friends, like uh, I come from India where you have, you know, 1.2 billion people and I was not one of the brightest students but somehow I got the visa and other guys, their visa got rejected. So uh, luck plays a very, very important part in life for sure, I feel. But luck bring you to a place, but to sustain there, it's your for hard sure. work. So what I hear from you is just, it's not only luck, but you are very curious too. Like you had a day job, but still thinking about other problems and trying to figure it out. And then the persistence you showed. And, and focus and focusing on the right thing. I think these are the very important thing which I you know, just learned from you that you were making sure the thing you are doing is the right thing, putting the code in the right product or cut the losses quickly. So I think these are the important points. No, there, I agree there's a lot of influence that the engineer can sort of exert too, right? Like you're, you're in the code, you True. see the code, you know, you know, um, that counts for something. I mean, you know, you know exactly how long something's going to take versus so, so there's like a lot of things. And, and then you might be able to see something in there that says, hey, we could actually get something. We get 80 percent of this in like one sprint rather than three or four sprints. You know, little things like that. I mean, they just kind of add up. Right. They kind of compound over time, you know, uh, be, making putting you in a position where you could you could showcase to, to management that hey you know we've added immense value like you need to you need to grow this team you need to grow me you need to all of those things kind of come together and and so um yeah i think luck is involved but but you you have a lot of you know you're not like a passerby you, you have a lot of say I, I would say true 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 